you're looking to find the person who's on the inside not on the outside only yes you want beauty there's nothing wrong for you to get in beauty Rasulullah sallallahu alaihi told us that and most people like they'll look for one of four things okay so they're going to look for beauty it doesn't mean that you find the religion and you don't find the beauty it doesn't mean that look for at least beauty that is nice to you fine but religion must be something which you give priority to don't miss out on that and i'm going to tell you why a lot of people suffer later on because of these wrong choices have a beautiful person but have religion with it have a person with wealth but have the religion with it what's the point of you having wealth if you don't know have religion honestly what are you going to do you're going to destroy yourself i was telling a businessman the other day a businessman the other day i said listen bro i said you're trying to make the millions fine alhamdulillah may allah bless you may allah bless you with the millions but if you don't have taqwa if you don't have god consciousness then that money will ruin you that money will take you to ways that you know to areas that you never wanted to go in your life but the money will take you why because you've got no fear of allah inside you you've got no consciousness of allah inside you you do not want a man in your life who's got money who doesn't have allah in his heart honestly I'm telling you, it will it will lead you to a lot of problems you do not want a woman with money because some guys honestly i know one guy here he actually is up from north yeah he's not getting married i said why are you not getting married bro because because i'm waiting for the rich sister <laughs> boy told him to me you know like god doesn't want to work you know what i'm saying like just to hang around sit honestly for years every time i ask him he doesn't want to get married why because he's looking for a rich sister rich sister who's gonna basically you know people think that money solves everything money does not solve everything anyway if allah's blessed you with wealth alhamdulillah may allah bless you more there's nothing wrong in having wealth but you better have the deen okay if you don't have the deen if you don't have religion you're going to take yourself to destruction now the third thing rasulullah sallallahu alaihi said he said lineage people look for lineage like this family noble family this family yes it's all good have a good family have a good background but don't sacrifice the fourth one the most important one which is religion and when we get to religion what is religion is religion when you pray, pray five times a day no it's not religion doesn't stop there religion doesn't stop at the hijab religion is inside it's a state of the heart okay when you have religion inside you you're religious in every single setting it's not just you know when when other people see me that i'm religious no it's not just for you know just a few salahs oh yeah i've ticked the boxes no it's not that you're religious from the inside you're religious wherever you are wherever you go and you gotta you gotta ask those questions to understand so what kind of questions you're gonna ask you know the question you want to ask when you when you're seeing a prospect you want to ask the question which masjid do you go to what's what the masjid you frequently go to which sheikh do you, do you listen to online and now you get into something because now if they say i listen to this sheikh that sheikh that sheikh it gives an idea of the person mentality then you say to the person okay what are the favorite quotes you've heard from the shuyukh right now we're getting into proper fights you know what i'm saying like before marriage like now after marriage bro you know what i'm saying before marriage ask these questions what are the favorite quotes of a sheikh now if she says my favorite sheikh my favorite sheikh is so and so and he said you know when a husband comes home he cleans all the dishes for me and does everything in the house and he looks after things he's my favorite guy my favorite quote yeah you listen to that bro yeah all right when the lawyer boy can i ask that do that basically you're gonna if you love that bro if you love that alhamdulillah go for it honestly there's some men who like this honestly there's one talk i gave i think it was in the middle and somewhere and the brother you know please hand up he said i happily do all the chores of the house mashallah alhamdulillah good alhamdulillah barakallah fiq and may allah bless you but there are men who don't want to do that and there are women who want that done now you better start talking about this in front of the mahram as i said in front of that father father figure in front of that you know the brother is uh, the older brother of hers who's there to prevent the loose talk you want to ask these questions because there are different sets of uh, the different mindsets that we have you better get to know those mindsets before you get into that marriage now